<sighs> just real fast, just real fast. I, as you had to kind of kneel, so if it splashes, you can kind of move. So we're gonna start servicing everything, but he's gonna show me again how to do this. Because yeah. this is the tractor that's gonna do all the tillage this winter, and it's due for a service anyway. So fresh. before we keep going with tillage, we're gonna at least service this. I know somebody already jumped in it though. Well, somebody's in the front. That's always the worst feeling when you don't know if all your cats are around. Oh, I just, I can't imagine the feeling of knowing you shredded one of your cats in a tractor engine. But anyway, we are going to get the oil changed on that thing so it's nice and fresh. Going over that culture chisel. So neat, it's like an assembly line all in one. There's a lot of stuff that goes on when they're using that thing. For the future, okay, it's not something that is used every single year. It is something that is going to help in the long run. going to the shop hopefully one day I can learn how to do all this kind of stuff on my own so that I can actually help if he has a million other things to do which is like 79% of the time corn Come on, then. they have to follow us everywhere they get into everything too that's the downside of spoiling barn cats Let it three quarters full, sideways, move it, right? Right? You're, I don't know, you're telling me. All right, if I make a giant mess, I want it to fall out, so. Yeah, oh, it's got a lot of threads, it'll be fine. What do you mean? You can break it loose, and then you still have to unscrew it like That's a long That's what ways. I thought, and I have to get my hands in the oil, right? Not really. It's gonna, like, come out. Here, make, hang on, get your crescent on there all the way. You don't want to strip it or ground it. We shouldn't be using a crescent anyway. Oh, it's that's not what even I had on there all the way. Put your foot up on the side of the motor if you have to, or the side of the block. I'm scared. Thing, whatever you want to call it. It's oh. kind of all one thing on these. Transmission, pan. Hello. Your sister made me this hoodie and I can't ruin it. Oh, so it is working then. You can pull up the overlay of the map and you can still see. Yeah, like, like we, we use the same map for a lot of different stuff. So it's not necessarily that it's just you can't see every map for see see where they lay out. And see where we are on the map and according to that. So I just real fast, just real fast. I, I was you, I had to kind of kneel. So if it splashes, you can kind of move. <laughs> George, Jordan's changing the world. Yeah. We'll see how that's going. There you go. Okay, get your other bucket ready.
Well, but it seems like, here you go. It seems like that work. Next step. Okay, you've drained the oil. What now? Filter. Yeah. And I think I remember where it is, but I'm not, I'm not all the way sure. Wait, no, that's one you're taking to the house. Where do we put everything? Well, just let's get your old filter out first. You're gonna need a pan. It's, it's still on the, oh no, it's right there. There you go. It's that big one. Yeah. Here our stuff and then we'll reconvene. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> That you want to get further this way. So Is, can, yeah. Are you doing an instructional video on how to do this? Sure. <laughs> no. So what are we doing now? We're taking the filter out. <laughs> you know what you're doing. You don't have to sound unsure. Because I am unsure, especially saying it on camera. It's like, <laughs> now you know how I feel. Do I sound stupid? <laughs> <laughs> now you know how I feel all the time. I know, because I'm like, you I, know I how swear. to do it. Just instruction. Ninety percent of the stuff I say is so stupid. No, it's not. <laughs> so we're gonna take that filter cap off. <laughs> <laughs> I just tightened it some more for myself. This one might be kind of tight. These tighten up on themselves. There, you, there go. you go. Okay, now cut and then re put it on so that it. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm like, okay, I'll do that. <laughs> yeah, I know he goes to do it. I got it. <laughs> okay, this is kind of a pain. What? You're scary. It like it like clips in there. Oh. So you have to kind of. Oh, I got. It's hard it. to do it without getting your hands all over. I gotta touch it. Okay. Well, not really. You can kind of put the filter this? like this. You can kind of put it like this and then uh -huh. twist it like. There you. you go. Now don't get your lid all oily. I know, I already did, I think. Now, oh yeah, you can. Whoa. Now you're gonna take this, see this O-ring? Oh, I have to take that out? Yep, here. Take it off the other way, this way. You don't wanna get oil all over this if you can help oh, it. Oh, okay. So but this put one's it in the done. Pan. Yep. Yep. I'm scared. Push hard. There you go. Yay. Just, I'm not thinking about what my hand's touching, so then I'm just, is there, is that enough oil on it, or do you yeah. want more? No, I think you're good. Okay, so you're snugged up. You don't gotta crank it, just okay. nice and but snug. that's pretty snug, then. That's it. That is it on this side. What are these? Fuel filters. Oh, we don't mess with those, really? No, well, we did right at the beginning of the season, so they don't have very many hours on them. Oh, you want me to grab my bucket? No, we'll do that at the end. Oh, what else? What's next? I don't know now. What are you eating? She just, it's like eating. She's eating stickers off the tire. Yeah, probably. I think she is. <laughs> she's like, I'll get those off for yeah. you. Yeah, <laughs> she's used to All right, what now? I'm gonna clean off your We house. drain the oil, we put an oil filter in it. What's the next step? I really don't know. Is it put the oil, well, no. Walk oh, over. the oil, yeah, yeah. Put the thing back on. You just get your hand dirty in the. <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay. Yeah, don't drop it in the bucket. Stop. That wouldn't be good. I didn't I'm even think about that. I'm gonna drop it now because <laughs> this is bad. It's getting worse. <laughs> oh my goodness! That's the tracker. Oh real quick. my How about god! That? You just kind of gotta be <laughs> do it fast. <laughs> I didn't know where the hole is. Anyway. <laughs> Now he's using his fancy grease gun. Like this one has a steering cylinder leaking. A what? Steering cylinder leaking. Uh oh. This right here is your that? cylinder that helps steer and it's leaking oil out the bottom. Oh. I want him to do this part because we know that I am not learning not to get completely dirty and that thing is so shiny and clean. I just don't want to. Get it nasty. <gasps> They're already broke. <laughs> I heard it. You know it's done, <laughs> we're professionals, and you know it's done when it goes Okay, 
All right, that's on there. <sighs> well, I was gonna grease the fan drive. Look what I discovered. For one, can you see? Yeah, here. No, you have to hold it. Okay. I'm putting it right here. For one, that has a lot of play in it. But then I also noticed, here, can you get that? Yeah, I can see it. See that? Here, put it in. Your phone right now. There you go. Like Trade me. There you go. You got that? Yeah. Can you see that? That belt's on its last leg. All the cleats are gone off of it. Looks like it has been slipping the pulley in there's all black, like the belt's shredded. Yeah, I think it's fan drive time, which if anybody knows anything about 8R gear tractors, this is like the most common issue. Oh. Sweet, like... time to do a fan drive. Recording instead of doing your job. <laughs> that is my job. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's true. Not <laughs> ASMR. <laughs> Ready to start? He had me, oh Jesus, he had me start it and then he greased the rest of that. I think I already said that. We don't know what's gonna be next, but. Um, next, we need to get that fan drive fixed now that we found that. Yeah, really but it's good just, because. Yeah, I'm really glad we found that. Just kind of making sure we're prepared to do more tillage because we have lots of tillage that we're gonna do this Wee, winter. Yay. We still need to. You need to start washing stuff. <laughs> and I guess that's what you're gonna see next. Good morning, guys. It is the day. We're gonna do a lot of chores today. Hopefully we can get all of it done. Hopefully. So we're gonna get started this morning. It's in the other side. I don't know how long it's been like that. Half of it's what's holding it together. Oh gosh. Wait, so it, it snaps? Is it because of the weight of it? Probably. Over time? Yeah, that's always scary. Everybody kind of, it's just like, oh yeah, that happens. And I'm like, there's a big bowl missing.
Well, he got the deal out. <laughs> Where? Oh my Come gosh, here. she acts so pathetic. Come here. She's like, help me. Save her. She's in danger. Save her from the evil BT. Well, Zach left me all alone to uh, grease this whole thing by myself. And I never would have realized how many grease serps there are until he pointed them out. This thing has quite a few. There's like two on each rolling basket, I think that's what they're called. And then these are called drops, I believe. And there's one every couple of blades. So we got two sets of those and then three rolling baskets and then guess what else? I'm like talking to y'all like you don't know. You probably already know. But then you got one on each tire as well. And that one can't get over grease because you can screw it up and pop a seal on the other side. So I'm doing it with this to just see how it really is. And then I'm gonna switch over to the fancy one and see the difference, cause I'm always kind of curious. The dogs get too excited and they knock over my dang cameras all the time. Okay. Wonder how many times, how many bumps on the head does it take to get an entire VT grease? We're about to find out. Freaking mess. All right, 50 more to go. Okay, I got all these done, and now we're gonna bust out the big guns. After we fix things that you broke. <laughs> yeah, I didn't break anything yet. <laughs> Placing a grease serp is what yeah. you're doing, and that's just because you think one is clogged or broken. It won't um, take grease. It's hard to say. Sometimes it's the Zerk, sometimes it's right under the Zerk. It's hard to say for sure. Uh-oh, watch your hoodie. There's that grease on the left side of that tire. The end like broke off and it plugged the hole. Oh. That's why Have it won't take that? grease. Yeah. They'll do that sometimes. That'll happen on your bigger jobs. <laughs> I'm going inside. Look at me like that. She's going to help. Okay. Until she goes feral and claws your neck. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Get me in the jugular. One loud sound and you're toast. Well, that's the end of the vlog because I can't go anywhere because she has ownership of my lap at the moment. <laughs> the, uh... Oh, this got revved on the end and it closed up the hole. Just in case Blake's watching. <laughs> That'll work. <laughs> Don't look. <laughs> Sorry, Blake. <laughs> Grease now. Next, we're gonna need the air hose. face for that. No, we would <laughs> never do that. <laughs> Did you hear that laugh? That's not an innocent laugh. <laughs> Third try is the charm. <laughs> so this lobule is the root of all of our problems at the moment. This is going to make a 20 minute job turn into three hours. <laughs> but I'm it's learning that's that, the, the normal thing. The, the grease zerk is fine, I think. It's this that was that was uh, plugged off, melted off. Surely he got it. 
think we're out of grease. Now. Are yep, we? We're out of grease, but yeah, we Just did get it. Nice, perfect timing. Gotta go get another deal. Top right. Oh, yep, very top right. Okay, let's see if I can climb on all these fertilizer pumps. Some of these parts move, so I've slipped and almost fell a few times. Easy. <laughs> there you go. What do you got going on over here? I'm making a mess. I'm covered in whatever this is, <laughs> and another one of these is broke. The problem is, this is in the middle of the thing, and that's on the outside of the thing. That's why I did that one, you're doing this one. <laughs> yeah, you're like, I better get this one done because I know <laughs> that one's gonna be messed up in there. So I have to get... Oh, I see your issue. What's my yours issue? Is, yours is down inside of there. Mine was up oh, above that. I was Sorry, like, I didn't know that. How the heck did you grab it? It's because it's Yeah, you need a, a you need a, I'll get you a little ratchet. I got it loose. You need a little ratchet with like, I think they're 10 mil on there, maybe eight millimeter. Here, here, show the people. There you go. Can you see it? Yeah. Hey. All right. Let me get you a ratchet and socket. Yeah. Well, I fixed it all the way up to the point. I put it all back together. He drilled a hole in it like he did that other one. And then I put it all back together and I tried to pump some grease in there and it wouldn't take it first. So I left it alone because I didn't want it to start shooting grease everywhere and I didn't want to mess with his stuff. So then we went in the house, ate, and then he came out here and it just worked for him first time. Just, you know, I had to get through that first part, I guess, but it worked. So now we're gonna finish this up. We gotta check tire pressure on all the tires and move on to the next thing. Okay, he's lifting it up. We're gonna get the tire, those two tires aired up on that outside edge. He's gonna pull it out there a little ways. And then we are going to wash off those windows on that tractor. That's the one I drove most to harvest. And it was, it's pretty nasty. So we're gonna get that all cleaned up and aired up and it'll be ready to VT. Okay, let's get up in here. Air this up. Really awkward angle in here, like cramped up under here. Getting pretty good at measuring the amount of time I have to clear this up. Let's check it. Should be 45. Oh, five more. Okay, now for my, oh my God, my hands are dirty. Favorite part. Oh, geez, that was a little bit more powerful than I thought. All right. We're using the fancy boys. I don't know which one he needs first. We'll do the wider one. He's gonna blow this off. Put that screw in there. Doesn't that seem like really scary? Okay. Well. Works. What are you doing? No, no, I'm just doing what I'm told. <laughs> Why am I here? <laughs> no, it's been a productive day. Sorry, let me grab this battery charger. I'll meet up with you in the other shop. Loud noises going on over there, but I haven't held the camera today. It's been a pretty productive day. We got the VT already, got to switch chargers. I'm sure George's filled you in on all this, so I'll try not to make my my uh, thoughts too long-winded. But we got the VT all hooked up and ready to go. Jordan's blowing out radiator on that tractor. And it is all serviced. We got steering cylinders fixed. We got the fan drive fixed, new belt put on. That tractor should be ready to do some tillage. So that is all done. Tractor's ready. I am 
moving the forklift so I can get the sprayer out, I'm gonna go air purge out the boom and we're gonna get that thing all washed up. Let's get this uh, sprayer out, see what happens. spare your ears from any more loud noises. I appreciate you so much if you made it this far. This was kind of special to me because this was my first time for a lot of things in this video. For all of my city friends that are just like me, hopefully this kind of taught you a little bit of something. I think changing the oil was my favorite part. It taught you anything. It taught you that if I could do it, coming from the city, never learning how to do anything mechanical in my entire life, then literally anyone can do it. And you already know what I'm going to say next if you've been here for a while. 370,000 subscribers. As always, I am at a loss for words. I am in shock and awe every single day at the amount of comments I get. I try my hardest to reply to every single one of them. And real quick, I already have a couple videos lined up for the future, but if you guys please have any requests, leave them in the comments down below what you want to see out of me during this winter before planting season comes up. Because in the next videos, aka the next couple weeks of my life, we are going to be cleaning some harvest equipment, me for the first time ever. Zach, like he said in this video, is going to be doing a lot of tillage and I'm going to be helping him with that to kind of relieve that stress and the time of doing it. That will also be the first time I'm ever learning how to do any of that. So I'm going to be going over that like a kindergartner, you know, learning something new. But gosh dang guys, am I excited? I hope you like these longer videos. Let me know if you did. Let me know if you didn't. Let me know if you like me. Let me know if you don't. As always, I'm very grateful for all my day ones and I'm also grateful for all the new people. If you're new, welcome to the mess. All of my real social media links will be linked down in the description below. Do not get scammed guys. Facebook is really bad right now, but you already know that. Appreciate you all for watching. I will shut up now and I'll see you guys in the next one. Okay, love you. Bye.